and gentlemen, the Sergeant Major of the First Recruit Training Battalion, Sergeant Major Williams. All right, Charlie Company, we pride ourselves on a high level of motivation and energy here on Paris Island. You have 194 of our nation's newest Marines outside that wall. Let's make some noise and let them know you're here. Now that's more like it. Again, good morning ladies and gentlemen. On behalf of our Commanding General, General Field, and Depot Sergeant Major, Sergeant Major Boda, welcome to Marine Corps Troop Depot Paris Island in today's Family Day event. Now shortly, you're going to meet your new Marine and be able to discuss with them firsthand their experiences while you're in group training. But first, let's talk about that training here on Paris Island. Training is very demanding and it is broken into four distinct phases. First phase, by far the most demanding, because the recruits have to adjust both mentally and physically to the training environment. Second phase, while reinforcing the training that was taught in first phase, more advanced skills are learned, such as marksmanship and basic order training. Most focus goes into instilling teamwork, esprit de corps, and our core values of honor, courage, and commitment. In third phase, the molding of the basic and trained Marine is complete. The transition goes from training to mentoring. The recruits finish their final team building event, the Crucible, and they earn their eagle, globe, and anchor, making them Marines. In fourth phase, we allow our new Marines to embrace and grow into their new earned identities. They have accomplished several areas and aspects throughout the training. The end result? A basically trained Marine that has completed the objectives of recruit training and proven themselves worthy to earn that title, United States Marine. More importantly, they understand their obligation to this great nation, the Marine Corps, and to you all. Ladies and gentlemen, these are the Marines you will see today. These are your United States Marines. Responsible for this transformation is our legendary drill instructors, sergeants, and staff non commissioned officers who come from all over the Marine Corps and they bring with them their leadership and operational experience. They attend a demanding drill instructor school right here on Paris Island and they become subject matter experts in all aspects of recruit training. And they're also experts in time management because every minute of the weekly training schedule is accounted for. Their normal work week exceeds 100 hours. So I'd encourage you to meet them, shake their hands, and thank them for a job well done. Round of applause for our drill instructors, please. All right, now let's talk about what happens after graduation. 10 days of well-deserved boot camp leave. Now, during this boot camp leave, encourage our new Marines to go out of town and find those that have what it takes to be a Marine and refer them to their hometown recruiters. Now ladies and gentlemen, your new Marine is going to be very vulnerable for their first 24 to 72 hours after leaving the island. In short, they have not stayed up late, driven a car, consumed alcohol, or tobacco products. We need your help in keeping them safe for their next follow-on assignment. What is that follow-on assignment? Well, after boot camp leave, all Marines will report to the School of Infantry because every Marine is a rifleman. Infantry Marines will attend Infantry Training Battalion and then move on to the Fleet Marine Forces. Non-Infantry Marines will attend Marine Combat Training, move on to their Military Occupational Specialty Schools, and then the Fleet Marine Forces. So, as you can see, the mystique of Paris Island is truly about the hard work performed on the broad shoulders of our dedicated drill instructors. From here, we will go on to win our nation's battles and produce quality citizens back to society. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor and privilege and the moment you've been waiting for 
to introduce you to our course newest Marines, the Marines of Company C. Hurrah!
Please be seated. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, we will introduce the drone instructors of Company C. We ask that you please hold your applause until all the drone instructors have been introduced. The chief drone instructor of the 1016 series is Gunner Instructor Hicks from Elderton, Pennsylvania. The senior drone instructor of the 1016 is Gunner Instructor Turner from Boise, Louisiana. He is assisted by drone instructors Gunner Instructor Demand from Greenville, Tennessee, Gunner Sergeant Thompson from Sandstone, Virginia, and Staff Sergeant Carter from Swainsboro, Georgia. The Senior Drone Instructor of Platoon 1017 is Staff Sergeant Whitney from Memphis, Tennessee. He is assisted by Drill Instructors Staff Sergeant Dominici from Boston, Massachusetts, Sergeant Atal from Long Island, New York, and Corporal Stanley from Plymouth, Pennsylvania. The Senior Drone Instructor of Platoon 1018 is Staff Sergeant Paul Ripkins from Trenton, New Jersey. He is assisted by Drill Instructors Staff Sergeant Rodriguez from Roxborough, North Carolina, Sergeant Dingle from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, and Sergeant Richards from Long Island, New York. The Chief Drill Instructor of the 1020 Series is Staff Sergeant Shada Kiyokas from Guanica, Puerto Rico. The Senior Drone Instructor of Platoon 1020 is Staff Sergeant Hidalgo from New York, New York. He is assisted by Drill Instructors Staff Sergeant Sharkoon from Daytona Beach, Florida, Staff Sergeant Oliver from Alton, Illinois, and Sergeant Ford from Galena, Illinois. The Senior Drill Instructor of Platoon 1021 is Staff Sergeant McPherson from Zan, Illinois. He is assisted by Drill Instructors, Staff Sergeant Nichols from Denver, Colorado, Staff Sergeant Jarvis from Memphis, Tennessee, and Staff Sergeant Mack from Augusta, Georgia. The Senior Drill Instructor of the 2022 is Staff Sergeant Ryder from Bluegrass, Iowa. He is assisted by Drill Instructors, Staff Sergeant Ford from Baltimore, Maryland, Staff Sergeant Garcia from Galesburg, Illinois, and Sergeant Bayard from Houston, Texas. Ladies and gentlemen, the drill instructors of Company C. Company C is Captain Dern from Buffalo, New York. His series commanders are Captain Jordan from Fayetteville, Georgia, and First Lieutenant Parker from Buford, South Carolina. Please have a safe and enjoyable family day with your new Marine aboard the Recruit Depot. 